Hi everybody, this is your reading, the daily cards for one week from the 25th till the 1st of August. And welcome back, I hope the last week's daily, uh, daily reading uh, video uh, resonated with you and um, I hope you've had a beautiful week and we are just in Leo as I'm taping this on the 22nd. So we're into an active, uh, creative, logic, dominant uh, energy. So perhaps you might be more into this energy, uh, you might be more passionate, you might be more dominant, you might feel stronger and you're coming into action for what you want. Wow! You might even have more passion. Passion that could be uh, um, a job, a hobby or a new love. Right. So on the 25th we have the first card. We have the Queen of Hearts. So you might be meeting a Scorpio but don't exclude Cancer or Pisces. And you have the Stork. You might hear of um, a birth you might hear of a pregnancy you might hear of a new job this could or you might be finding out that you're pregnant especially if you're a cancer or if your partner is a cancer that they are pregnant wow the stalk also means moving home perhaps you have just bought a home with the queen of hearts this could be the woman of your heart or the man of your heart <laughs> but they, the man means that it is a nurturing, caring. The more the feminine side comes out a little bit more with the man. Okay, somebody that's loving, nurturing, passionate, sensual, and sexy or handsome. Okay, and you might be living, going to live together because you've just um, bought a new home. There's a 360 degrees turnaround in a situation. Something that thought you thought you had lost, you might have found. And you've got number 17, so that is 8. You're in your strength and in the powerhouse and the money house. There might be more money coming into you. Okay, and then we have the star. Look at that. Your wish is coming true. Or your goal. And then we have the Six of Hearts. The Six of Cups. You might be reminiscing about the past, perhaps your childhood. You might be uh, meeting somebody from the past. Somebody from the past could be coming back. You've got number 16, so that is 7. Luck is on your side, big time. Double luck, because you've got the star, and that's your wish coming true. So that is lucky, and then you've got number 7 to go with it. So you've got double luck. Then, on that is in the weekend, on Monday we have the bear. And the bear stands his ground, he's strong you'll be standing out and somebody might be jealous of you because you stand tall you stand strong you stand you show that you're certain of your goals your wishes and you are going to go for it now you've got the ten of clover here the ten of wands so there is an ending coming and a new beginning the the way to where you are now has been heavy okay but oh you're so certain of what you want and again this is a lucky card because luck in business luck in what you are passionate about or that you love you will protect it through thick and thin you're definitely balanced okay because you've got number 15 which is six and so six means balance you have found your balance it might be the ten or uh, the ten of ones um, but you definitely have lots of luck one two and now you've, your boat is coming in you like I said you might be moving home 
you might be moving actually in with somebody or somebody might be moving no, it's, I'm reading for you when you're listening to this so you might be moving in or moving home okay now the boat also says this moving home or going on holiday you might be even crossing water if it is uh, this could be a bridge that you go leave your home um, to go to work and you're crossing a bridge so that means that you were crossing water nine times out of ten the bridges are, bridges are built to bring uh, 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 two sides together like you are going to your loved one Woohoo! and you're moving in okay and again you've got the ten of spades here and which is the ten of swords somebody might have stabbed you in the back and you protected what you believed in okay and the truth has come out so there might be an end of a friendship and a new beginning if the, if you are going back to walk to to your partner if this is a reconciliation luck is on your side if that is what you've wished but it might cost a friendship because somebody might be jealous like I said the bear is also that somebody is jealous but you've got the three three is creating creation creativeness you've been creative enough to get this rolling and look at it two tens become two endings and this could be an ending of being alone an ending of a friendship of a jealous person and you've stood your ground well and protected yourself and what you love and your boat is coming in this could be love this could be anything abundance okay and of course this becomes a one and that becomes a one so that's 11 you can see it either as an 11 a doorway that the angels are giving you or as two ones two new beginnings whatever there might be more new beginnings right now we have the ace of swords you have victory you have clarity you have justice you might move in with somebody and start a re new relationship and you might start a new study as the ace of swords the swords stand for wisdom so this could be a new study but this could also be a new job and um, this could be a new job but you might have to cross water for this or you might have to travel from your home over a bridge to your job like I said or to a school you might have to move in order to get this study just as clarity will prevail here you've got number 29 11 again so you've got 11 11 very significant right so you might also meet a Gemini a Libra or an Aquarian the air sign okay then we have the king of swords the king of spades you'll just have to believe me and trust me that is Gemini but don't exclude Libra or Aquarius you've got the lily from the Lenaman so the lily means luck in business okay luck at work you are making clear-cut decisions and it's brought you to this new beginning perhaps a new prom a, 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 a promotion okay going up a level a new beginning and the king of swords knows the letter of the law so you could be studying something to do with law it could be an advocate it could be a social worker it could be a judge anything to do with the letter of the law you might seek advice from a mature man this could not only be an air sign but or a professional but this could also be your father or a mature man that you have respect for perhaps your partner or your father like I said besides the professional and that is on a Thursday 
and you've got 30 so you've got three three again the angels are with you this I've never seen so many numbers double Phew, in one reading again you have luck you have the clover okay you have the clover that means luck also the flowers in the clover sometimes they're pink sometimes they're white but seeing those flowers means that you might be remembering good memories from the past you've got the six of diamonds so you will get help if you're less fortunate and by looks of this reading you if you are fortunate more fortunate then you will be giving um, to the less fortunate this could doesn't have to be always money it can also be a listening ear a helping hand a gift of something because here we've got the advisor okay let's have a look and we've got a uh, victory here that's the like the judged the judgment card that you've um, you've had to go into judicial situation professional advice and you've won wow and you've got six six again again a double number you're definitely in balance luck is there luck is here and your boat is coming in so end to difficulties and luck in new beginnings wow now this is this doesn't have to be on this specific day the energy is throughout the week you can take it uh, you can come back every day and look at your day or you can take the whole reading as an extra week reading now I'm going to take a, a card from the angels reading angel cards they're really big they're a bit difficult to sho shovel and we've got bullying prevention the angel of prevention wow so you might feel a bit uncertain or scared somebody might be bullying you but remember the angels are here big time for whoever is watching this week's re daily reading it's powerful don't let anybody bully you ask advice from a mature man or a mother because we've also got the lady okay and sh she could be a Gemini or a Libra or an Aquarian and she'll cut straight through to the uh, to the to the core this lady she will get clarity she will get the um, truth out all right so it could be mum, it could be dad, or it could be an uncle or somebody that you respect. It could also be a teacher, okay? Now I'm going to use a, a card of one of my other favorite decks, Oracle decks. The Ah, oh, I've got such beautiful, I'm so blessed with all these beautiful cards. I hope you enjoy them. Let me know which one you like the best whether it's the Enchanted uh, Lenormand or whether it's the uh, Shadowlands or Metatron or the uh, Angel Reading Card okay what do we have here oh, this is personal this is so beautiful the Robin he's the favorite card of the whole deck that's my holy bird you know the story if you don't let me know it's the holy bird for me 50 so signs number 50 you won't be in balance you might not feel in balance especially if you're scared or being bullied okay so yes the angel of prevention is with you and that is what the robin is also saying so from spirit with love well and i, I didn't i don't know these cards by heart but that's the holy bird and, and that is what the robin means to me and then it says here from spirit with love because I can never remember all the cards of course nobody can just the basic meaning of the Lenormand and the tarot I do remember 
but with the beautiful cards that I have sp special decks like the Shadowlands and the Enchanted Dream Tarot you see so much more like today I was doing the reading for Aquarius and I saw something in one of the cards in the enchanted cards that I hadn't seen before and it was just like the angel wings so I think the angels are even more here than they were I think they are protecting everybody more with this second lockdown in some countries they are here to protect us even more than before they've got loads of work so if you can help them by praying or holding thought for them for just one second or when you contemplate or meditate think of the divine and the angels give them some energy just by your thoughts and let's stop bullying don't be discriminated okay don't be horrible to other people don't let other people be horrible to others step in be the angel if you see somebody being bullied, bullied, then step in, be the angel. Okay. I hope you will have a beautiful week. And I hope the sun will shine upon all of you. And take care and be blessed and please stay safe. And I hope to see you in the life. And if not, in the next video. Ciao, ciao. Please share and like. Love you all.